Ryan, is Victron components, are they RV user friendly? And then another question is once you use these components, should you stick with the same brand? Yeah, so Victron, Victron Energy in itself is a very technical company. Um, when you look at Victron itself, I mean, there's, you know, al almost 50% of the employees are R&D engineers. And so you're going to find that there's a lot of products. There's a lot of products that look the exact same. Um, they, I think I might be moving a little bit out of the way, but they are very technical. And so when it comes to being technical, they communicate very well and they communicate with each other very well. And if they come out with a new product, they have a patch to make all of their other products communicate with that new product very well. And so this is a very technical item and you're working with solar and you're working with tracking and you're working with inverting and you're working with loads and temperature coefficients and there's so much going on they do have some very easy ways to to interact with them and so we have a victron connect app so on the smaller systems where you're really not tied into any wi-fi you're not tracking this online you just want to pull your phone out and you want to see what your panel is doing or what this component is is doing or what the history is all of those smart devices within the victron uh, world if it's labeled smart it has bluetooth capability and it is going to give you information you can make it where it's just a quick glance or you can actually open up that component specifically and look at histories and make settings and adjustments so it is very very easy to use um, on the larger systems the moment you add a what we call a gx device it starts gathering information from all of the peripherals so instead of the charge controller being one item that you could log into or your you know inverter with a dongle a separate item now this GX device, it takes everything, it's the hub, and it is tracking all of that information. So at that point, you have what Victron calls the um, uh, VRM, Victron Remote uh, Management, and you can log in, you can see history, you can make your own custom uh, dashboard that is tracking all the information that you want that's in the advanced area so you really get a good idea um, you don't have to always be hooked up to the wi-fi for people that are going out and camping over the weekend um, when you bring the rv back home you can have uh, it download all of that information there's a way for the moment it sees your network it uploads that last five days of camping and then you can unload, clean the, uh, the unit, put it back into storage, and then you can look at that information at your own convenience. Um, so very, very user-friendly. The key is, is why, why would you want to have part of that information tracked and not all of that information tracked? You know, if you're putting in a lithium battery and your lithium batteries have a CAN bus communication that puts all of its information up into that same cloud network. Why not after you come back from a trip to you know, Montana or even further north, why not be able to actually look and see, oh my goodness, you know what? Remember we were having some issues and look, we can see that our actual cell, our battery cells were imbalanced during that time. And we can now look and go, oh, you know, next time we see that, we can now know maybe it's worthwhile to stop in somewhere and plug in for a night, let the batteries fully recharge so it recovers from that. Um, but not only that, not even 
post-trip, you can do it mid-trip. What's going on? Let's pull up that VRM information. Let's look at that dashboard. I can't make heads or tails of this. Maybe the company that sold me this and put this in, maybe they could take a few minutes to look at it and see if they could help me troubleshoot that information. So we're in, a, we're in an information age. If you can store it, if you can track it, if you can recall it later and start making some decisions off of that, I mean, that's just, that's gold right there.